hello in this video we will see how we can remove all the junks from our windows computer it is applicable for all versions of windows like windows 11 windows 10 windows 8 windows 7 and so many so let's see how we can remove all the junks only four steps listen only four steps and if you follow these four steps then all junk will be cleaned from your computer and your computer will be super fast so let's see the first step click on the start menu and start typing run and you will find run application is there this is a system run application just click here to open it now start typing prefetch p r e f e t c h and hit enter key of your keyboard it will give you this option you don't currently have permission to access the folder just press continue and then you will find this thing just select all by holding ctrl a key all together and then press the delete button and this will be deleted shortly one or two file will not be deleted that is fine and now close it so first step is done now second step just click start menu again then start typing run again and open the run application this time i'm going to type percentage temp this thing and then hit ok button and this folder will be there now again select all of them and delete and it will take some time see how many junks it is removing already 2.64 gigabyte items remaining right it is increasing right so this way it is going to remove all the junks it is a big saver it will be like i think 3 gigabyte 3 gigabyte completely see how many files it is deleting okay so once it is removed then we are going to close this window during the deletion process of these files if you get this thing you can press try again and if it is not able to delete those thing just check this thing and then press the skip button so basically couple of files will be remained and then rest of the things will be deleted see here it is showing 99 percent completed okay so during the completion of this thing i'm going to close this thing and i'm going to open the run again this is the third step i'm going to type run and this run application is there now this time we will type only temp so i'm going to remove the percentage signs from and beginning and end and just type in temp and then press the ok button and now again it is giving me warning you don't currently have permission to this folder so i'm going to click continue and here we are finding this thing so one application is open i'm going to close this thing so that it will be faster two applications basically i just close this thing now we need to select all of them and same way we need to click delete and then we have to press the continue button and it will start deleting everything so again i'm going to try it so it is not deleting so i'm going to skip it and then it will be deleted shortly now i'm going to close this thing and finally the last step again click the start menu or search menu then start typing run and open the run application and start typing on last command that is called c l e a n m g r clean manager and then hit ok button and it will be opened like this way so from here at first we will click this one system uh, clean up system files and once we click there it will clean everything okay basically it is not cleaning uh, cal it is calculating everything all together how much space it will be clean like that way so you have to wait few more seconds and after that we have to check all the check boxes so now the window is open okay now from here we just need to check everything from here 
so i'm going to check all of them and it's still on is remaining and after clicking everywhere then it's time to press the ok button and here we are seeing that it will free space like 2.44 gigabyte okay which is a lot like big space so i'm going to press the ok button and very soon it will prompt us this type of thing are you sure you want to permanently delete these files yes i am that's why we have to choose delete files and once you click the delete files it will start cleaning everything and it will take some time if your computer hard disk is like one terabyte or more than that it will definitely take some time uh, it will be like five to ten minutes at least for my case it will be faster because the hard disk is not that much bigger and also it has less number of uh, junk okay and i'm not going to wait till it is finished okay i think it's finished okay so that's it guys in this way we can easily clean everything and we can remove all the junks from our computer and this process these four steps is applicable to any version of windows it doesn't matter whether windows 10 or windows 11 or windows 8 or windows 7 or some other operating system of windows that's it guys after following these four steps you can easily make your windows 11 much more faster and it will be junk free thank you guys for watching the video